try and get multiple X's uh, to show up on. Oh, oh that yeah. would have been fun. It, it took him a while. He didn't yeah. uh, He didn't get all five, but uh, he did get a lot of them, which was... Wow. That's impressive. Yeah. Oh my god, no, not like this! He's out, yeah. Jesus! Oh! Just for good measure. It's just, that's all you Double need. Double King just smiling. So, like, that's what happens when you play a very edge guardable character. Yes. Um, and Ganondorf is the edge guardable character. So, you know, here all we right. are. You know what? He's never out. He's just down. I mean, theoretically, correct. It even extended Ooh. on the top. Oh. And this get that up was animation was still able to bypass it. That's. Insane. And Deke, and Dumpling King's callouts, his uh, his callouts and his ability to like make reads, mm -hmm. even just little reads, are so like they're very consistently on point, having played against him. But, oh yes. No, this man doesn't give up. But, he just finds new ways to come back. But no. Rob, but Rob is a, it's a different beast, man. It's just so hard to like Get, I, it's hard. It's so hard to get through like the generalist that is Rob right now. Right, because you have the gyro, yeah. you have the range, yeah. but DK has the gyro. But not for long though. We do have some burst options here. We have Wizard's kick. We have the jab. We have those up smashes. Yeah, those are the types of plays that you kind of have to make as Gandorf in most matchups. But because uh, Dill is a very comfortable with our character and very comfortable at playing a multitude of ranges. Plays like those where you like hold away from the ledge, get the final hit, and then drift back in. You've got to make those early and often. And if you're pulling into your bag of tricks and stop to a game one, that's a really early to start trying to go for mix-ups. Yeah. Oh, but there we go. Answering right back, just brute forcing that first stock. Oh no. Oh, Here damage. we go. That's that. Uh, that's the the dopamine coming off when you find that uh, find that tech roll read. Some information gathered a little early. Going for the side beat. Out of shield though. I what do I think, like it. What I think Dumpling King has been doing a lot better in this Ooh. bracket and in yesterday's bracket is he's trying to find those shield pokes a lot more and doing that up special out of shield. And those up smashes have been so on point, having learned his lesson from the gyro in second stock. He's like, I can do this now. You're coming from above. It's the same theory, just in a better placement. And that's right. If oh, something doesn't oh work God, at wait. first, it doesn't mean don't try it again. It says maybe just adjust it a little bit. You were cooking for a moment there. 65 can be can be, can be curtains if you play your cards right. Great delay there from Dumpling King into the falling there. One of Ganon's best options. I think he wanted a cross up there from Dumpling King. And this is it. DI. Yeah. That's tough. Dumpling King uh, nodding his head. But he was fighting back. Yeah, I mean, ferociously. The, the X factor of heavyweights is like it is what it is on display, can, right? Can I get a Can I get a pun in real quick? Go for it, Hit please. Right. Stand please. by your puns. So here we're gonna see a kill off the top. Oh my off god! Off the top. Boom. <laughs> like I want to see at what point that extended. Yeah, we can we can right? count the hit lag, right? Like, like oh my god! So it, so it hits right at the beginning, right here. Yes. And then you go like one, two, three. Like this is the arc. Yeah. Right. Look how look how much slower it's going because it hit the top. Like the. Exactly. And then and it starts going time. again. Like <laughs> incredible. Like. So we're 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 hung up here. We're hung up here, and right. then it starts to move. Oh gosh, frame but by frame. But we're hung up here, and then yeah. Boom. It's like you can delay it, like, God, if he could actually like, delay it. Like, I know you can delay it, but, like, you can literally delay it in yes. charge. Yeah, but, like. <laughs> not the same, not as cool. It's, a, di if, it's a different mix up, it's a different timing. And oh, going for the early get up attack there from Dill instead of waiting a beat like she had been in the previous set. A lot of the times in those tech scenarios, you can call out players for being antsy, but instead, this is Dill playing us. Just a hair faster, just that extra beat where. Oh, no. You're starting to utilize Rob's insane buttons. That was starting to look like a repeat of game one there, but Dumpling King finally managing to make it back. But back into the blunder. Ooh. Just going for the up air there. I wonder if she, if the coverage with the up tilt into up air would have closed out the stock there. Maybe not with good DI, but against against Ganon, you're just trying to find that first hit so you can keep him in disadvantage forever. And Top is doing a great job of that right now, Swiss. Right, you just really, really want to just make no sure that uh, you're keeping them in the blunder. You're keeping them off stage, and eventually something's gonna kill, like this. Easy, easy money. Just but like you know, that. 
70%? This is, well, from 0 to any percent is kill percentage for Ganondorf. Trying to recreate that magical second stock from game 1. Yeah, it's a good matchup check, but the amount of dash back, in, dash back gameplay that Dill can play right now is real good. Going for the charge, anticipating the spot dodge, but with all of these up smashes, you might find uh, Dumpling King having the opportunity to find some more grabs going into uh, later into this game. The Nair again comes down. But One of us before that, he's got to find a kill. Finally does with that up special. He's been doing such a good job actually grabbing those shields, calling those defensive options out. Can he make it back? Yes, he can. Just barely. It's the one recovery route, but uh, honestly, I'd, I'd rather see Dill just like go off with these drop zone fares, maybe if, like ledge slip fair as well. Like just go off and hit him. Yeah, don't be afraid. It's Ganondorf. He's even stocks. Now, if he was up a stock, it'd be a different story. Yeah. And I respect the, especially with this high percent, like you're just, you're in so much control at this point. And yeah, yeah, you can set up that You dare. don't have to respect low tiers because they don't respect you. Disrespect your low tiers. That's right. They don't have rights. <laughs> yeah, we're taking it real slow. And this is what you should do, right? Like, especially as Rob, like, you have the buttons to beat out Ganondorf at close range. Top dominates the mid range. Right. And then late. Oh, no. That. Oh, gosh. Yeah, laser the and high lag. Bloody cover the long range. You're just. You've got it all going on. Trying to. In between the top, the jump out of shield, just barely getting him by, but not without killing that shield. Oh, right, no boy. defensive options left for Dumpling King. He's got to brute force his way through this. Oh, not just kick, any burst option, a dash. Trying to find the up air. Oh, no. Oh, an unfortunate tech. And he's not going to make it back. And that's GG's ending his run at fifth place. Still, of course. Like, I feel like whenever I come to Xeno, I see Dumpling King like do something do something real nice. Like the last yeah. time I was here, I think he beat PK Chris. Yes. No, and, it was a great game. And now, you know, getting fifth, win on numbers, win on, and uh, plenty of other individuals like Sano, uh, LRA Start, uh, Maniac, the no, I player. He's like, coming out and he's showing that like, hey, I am somebody to like be taken seriously. You may yeah. not might like my character. You may not respect the low tier, but you got to respect me, the specialist. Yeah. He's clearly like objectively the worst character in this game. <laughs> How however, Little Mac exists. Do you watch Peanut play? Have you watched Dumpling King play? Have, have you watched Peanut play? Yes. He and is you amazing. still say Peanut and Little Mac is worse. That's crazy. I say Little me. Mac is worse. That's crazy to me. Who's worse and what? Is Ganondorf... Okay, this is like a really pedantic yeah. argument, but who's worse, <laughs> Little Mac or, uh, or Ganondorf? Uh, definitely Ganon. There you Dang. go. There you okay, go. all right. Like, the the crux of my statement was yes, that I'm even so the wor sorry. even the worst character in this game is still like a four or five out of ten, which <laughs> is like very much playable even if you are putting yourself behind the eight ball right at the jump. Yeah, we're going by uh, Google business rankings. Any anything that's a four and below, you stay clear. 